Hello AP students, this is Mrs. Politsky and I have notes for chapter 14, Making Cognitive Attributions. Social psychologists have found that we tend to attribute other people's actions and misfortunes to their personal traits, rather than to the situational forces. This helps explain why we often hear attributions of laziness or low intelligence to poor or homeless people rather than externally imposed by the lack of opportunity that they might face. People use the same process to explain each other's successes. Thus, we may subscribe the success of a favorite singer, athlete, or family member to personal traits such as their exceptional talent or intense motivation. The fundamental attribution error, sometimes known as FAE, uh, this is the tendency to emphasize internal causes and ignore the external pressure. Uh, the FAE is more common in individualistic cultures than in collective ones, which we have heard about a while back. Uh, the fundamental attribution error is referred to as a dual tendency to overemphasize personal traits by minimizing the situ situational influences. Uh, FAE is more pervasive in individualistic cultures such as the U.S. and Canada compared to collective cultures like Japan and China. Even within the United States, urban children are more susceptible to the fundamental attribution error than children in the rural part of our country. Bias thinking about yourself. When things go well, most people attribute their success to internal factors such as motivation, talent, or skills. And when things go poorly, they attribute their failure to external factors, things that are beyond their control. Psychologists have dubbed this tendency the self-serving bias. The self-serving bias is an attributional pattern in which one takes credit for the successes but denies responsibility for failure compared with the fundamental attribution error. The self-serving uh, bias is rooted in the need for self-esteem and a preference for interpretation to save face and to cast our actions in the best possible light. When we're trying to figure out uh, the reasons for our actions, we tend to look at the situational factors acting on us because we're more aware of them than the judgment of others. Thank you very much.